really. She drowned in the bathtub. It was Henry. Wasn't it? It wasn't Henry, father. It hasn't been Henry for a long time now. We found Lily in the tub. Maybe, maybe a girl wasn't moving. Ben, Ben beat Henry. Bad. He would have killed him if I hadn't stopped him. At the time, part of me considered letting him do it. You aren't. Oh. You weren't good enough. <laughs> and you knew it. That's why you married Wayne. I loved Wayne. Oh, so much so that you said, to hell with your career. Yes. And then got pregnant to prove that you meant it. Yes. Oh, don't lie to me. Lie to yourself. Oh. You got married because you knew you were second rate. And you got pregnant because Wayne was a ballet dancer. And in those days, that meant queer. So you had to prove he was a man. So you had a baby. That's a goddamn lie. That's the goddamn truth, oh. and you know it. You settled him with a baby and blew his career, and oh, and now she's all grown up and better than you ever were, and you're jealous. I'm Tracy. Please come inside. Are those real pearls? I used to have one just like that. Didn't they teach you about sex in school? Yeah. Well, there was no sex ed when I was growing up. Decent people didn't talk about it back then. No way. Yes way. <laughs> <laughs> My mother told me about menstruation, but sex was all hush-hush, like a dirty little secret. When I was a teenager, your Arnie Rose found a book. <laughs> I don't know where she got it from, but it was full of hand-drawn pictures of people's <laughs> I remember when Henry was born. He was the quietest child. He never once cried. Even when he got too big for me to hold him in my arms, he was, he was such a good boy. You will save him, won't you, Father? 